What's up guys, welcome back to another YouTube video, my name is Tom or Overload and today I'm coming at you with another commentary over on Carnage Tasty's channel. Actually today you're going to be seeing an unbelievable gameplay, it is in fact another world record dropped over on Carnage Tasty's channel today. It's actually going to be a world's first double nuclear in team deathmatch, he's playing on the map Breach with the Man of War, actually in a four man party, absolutely insane gameplay guys, a double nuclear in team deathmatch guys, what? What's going on there? If you think about it guys, if you get a double nuclear you have to get two sets of 30 gun streak kills uh, which means that that's a total of 60 kills in team deathmatch. If you think about that, that means that there's only 100 kills in TDM itself. So to actually get 60 of them is absolutely crazy considering he has other teammates that are playing two in the game. Pretty, pretty unbelievable guys and he's managed to do it in four minutes which is unbelievable as well. Considering it's team deathmatch and considering nobody else has done it before, a world's first absolutely fantastic gameplay guys make sure you drop a thumbs up on this video if you do enjoy and of course if you do enjoy my commentary then i'm still uploading daily on my channel too so come over and check me out link will be in the description guys and girls what i want to speak about today is firstly before i get into any major commentary topic i want to say thank you for the support you actually gave on my face reveal video now tasty came to me the other night and said to me hey dude i don't really have um actually i haven't made a commentary for any of the videos at the moment can i upload your face reveal now I know for, uh, for the more OG members of Tasty's channel, the, uh, the the guys who have been fans of him for a long time and long time subscribers themselves, they'll know that I actually dual channeled with Tasty a while back. And um, to be honest, um, I've never actually, oh, well, we kind of like separated and split, therefore we both went on in separate ways. Now, uh, I've been featured quite a lot on Tasty's channel. I'm actually, um, I actually manage what he uploads and stuff, and um, Tasty lets me do a lot of his commentaries because he doesn't really like commentating himself. So we thought, well, let's upload the face reveal just to you know, show the fans what I actually look like, consider him such a big feature on his channel. So that went up the other night. I really hope you enjoy that. Um, I always love or enjoy matching people's faces to um, to their voice, to what they sound like, because you always hear someone and think, oh, I, want, I wonder what he looks like. And, you know, uh, a lot of you got to see what I looked like the other day. That's absolutely fantastic. If you do want to go and see Tasty's face reveal, he's actually done it. He did it quite a while back now. Um, I'll try and get a link. I'll try. I'll try my hardest to get a link. Um, it's a long time ago, so I'll have to search quite a long way through. But he definitely did a face reveal. He made, he made it public again. So uh, I made sure he did that. But I'll get a link for you. Post it in the, in, like, the comment section below. Uh, so you can all see that for yourselves. But, guys, this gameplay in the background is absolutely insane. And my commentary topic of the day is actually going to be based around Call of Duty itself and I can't believe it's it's something that kind of like annoys me a little bit I can't believe that they're actually teasing the newest Call of Duty already I mean it's, it's only January and already we're looking forward to the next Call of Duty what's going on there it seems to me as though Call of Duty is now getting such a short life cycle it literally comes out for the first month and then a little bit of December where all the hype is real about it and then they get bored of it again and focus let's focus on the new Call of Duty guys the first DLC hasn't even dropped yet and people are already moving off to try and think about Ghost 2 or Modern Warfare 4. Guys and girls, Ghost 2 or Modern Warfare 4, you think about it here now. We all want Modern Warfare 4, but it's definitely not going to happen. I have reasons to believe that it's actually going to be a, another Ghost game. It's just mainly because it's just the way in which Call of Duty likes to roll. They always like to disappoint us every single year. Mind you, Treyarch don't. Treyarch never disappoints. Treyarch has done absolutely excellently in the past couple of years. They've never actually made the bad Call of Duty, I don't think. But uh, Activision and Infinity Ward together are both ruining Call of Duty themselves anyway. So it's probably going to be a ghost too. Let me know down in the comment section below what you think. Thank you very much for watching this video. And the gameplay in the background is actually coming towards the end. And so is my commentary too. But guys, I really do hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching and all support on the previous videos. But my name is Tom. Or guys, can call me Overload. And I hope to speak to you all in my next one.